Hi, this is another video in the series on tough questions. Uh, this was asked by one of my students. It's all to do with fractional indices. Please do stop the video, have a go at the question, compare your solution. If you've got any particular issues, always add a comment, come back to you. I look forward to seeing you inside the video. Okay, so in the question, we're given that 3 to the power of negative n equals 0 0.25. So what we need to do is convert that firstly to something that we can work with. We can rewrite this as 3 to the power of minus n equals 1 quarter. Now, that's the negative reciprocal. So therefore, we can actually write that as 3 to the power of n equals 4. And then really, it's a case of taking this value of 4 and putting it straight into the expression. So actually, the value of 3n squared is going to be 4 squared, which is going to be 16. And that's the answer to the question. OK, let's just do it again for question number two. You might want to stop the video and have a go at this particular question yourself. And we're going to use exactly the same principle that 5 to the power of minus n equals 1 quarter. Therefore, 5 to the power of n must equal 4. I'm going to take that 4 put it straight into the expression, so I'm basically going to get 4 cubed, and 4 cubed is the same as, say, 4 times 4 times 4, which is 64, and that's the answer to the second question. Okay, so hopefully that's okay for you. Please do add a comment below if you're not sure about anything. I'll always come back to you. I'll look forward to seeing you inside the next video.